now let us write a program which prints out whether the user enter alphabet is a character or not so we can write it in a file but there is a disadvantage writing in a file so if you write a program like 50 lines or 100 lines big program we cannot find the syntax error until we run the program until we after we complete and we run it then only we can find the uh, error so for that we have a debugging tool but I want to show you small trick I always write a program in a command cell if the syntax is correct I will just copy it and paste it in the file so let's start writing in the command cell first so in our program we want to find whether the user enter alphabet is a vowel or consonant so for that let us see input from the user because the input is a default string we need not have to specify as we have specified in our previous example like int input because it default is string we don't need to any specifications enter any alphabet now if you press enter yeah it is working fine so because this is correct I will just copy it and go to the file and paste it here so because it is a small program it doesn't make much difference here but when we are writing a large program it makes much difference so now let us write a if statements if what is the oval oval should be like if c is equal to is equal to a e i o u a and the logical or operator is this one or c is equal to is equal to e or c is equal to is equal to i same way o and u or c is equal to is equal to u when the user entered is any one of them or means either this or that if it is a e i o u then we should have to print the string the alphabet is over and we can also print the value like give the space we don't require space Q here comma and print the value of C and here also we have only we have only two conditions whether it is a vowel or consonant we don't have third option so for that else print the alphabet is consonant and print the value of C now let us try the output if it, the syntax is correct we will be just copying it and pasting it there so everything is fine the alphabet is well E because we have entered here e. now because this is correct I will be just copying it and here press the enter and paste it now we have successfully written our code so now let us run it I will be just pressing F5 from now go to the run or press F5 and OK enter any alphabet let me enter R let us execute one more time click F5 let us give R and press enter so the alphabet is consonant R is a consonant and if we want to one more go to the file click F5 
let us give a and this time the alphabet is a so here in the command cell now we can check what the variable c contains c contains a so like this we can write when we are writing in the big program this will be very helpful and the same way if you want to print this value run this as a executable file as I have mentioned enter and now go to the file save it now we can go to our file where we have saved this was our previous example so you should have to always remember where the file I have stored I have to search for it but I think you have understood it so this is how we'll be running and one more thing I want to tell you see when we when we run a file we are running still in a command line prompt but this is not visibly very pleasing we want a graphical like colors user entered we want some tabs we want some buttons like enter the number when we press the enter like that we'll be seeing in a CGI and GUI programming so that we'll be covering in that section so hope you understood keep practicing meet you in the next video